When you're pitting Metformin against Berberine for the heavyweight title of diabetes champion, you're not just comparing two different substances, you're also comparing two significantly different approaches to treatment. Here's the thing. Metformin has been the frontline medication for type 2 diabetes for what feels like eons. And there's plenty of good reason for that. It lowers blood sugar levels, improves the body's response to insulin, and even has the added bonus of being able to help with weight loss in some people. That last part is clutch, given the link between obesity and type 2 diabetes. The end game is reducing your body's insulin resistance. We want your body to handle insulin like a champ, so your cells get the energy they need. And the excess sugar doesn't just hang out in your bloodstream building Lego castles or something. But metformin isn't a freebie. Some folks deal with digestive system side effects that make them feel like they've just hopped off the world's fastest merry-go-round. Enter berberine, a compound found in several lovely plants that couldn't care less about human diseases, but happen to contain a chemical that might. Studies on berberine have shown that it can bring some of the same benefits to the diabetes table. It's like your body's own insulin cheerleader, enhancing its effects and again, reducing sugar in the blood. But, and it's a big but, not like Sir mix kind. Berberine isn't as well studied as metformin. We're kind of in the emerging evidence stage here. Many of the studies are smaller, and let's face it, in the world of research, size matters. You want conclusions drawn from a giant sample size so you can say, yep, this is legit. As for personal experience, because I'm in Portland, I'm surrounded by a culture that really values natural remedies. So I've heard a fair share of anecdotes about berberine being a miracle supplement. But when it comes to health, I'm a stickler for cold, hard facts over warm, fuzzy testimonials. So which one takes the cake for diabetes management? If you're a betting person, metformin is still your safest bet because it's been through the gauntlet of rigorous testing and come out on top. Berberine has potential, but it's still working its way up the ranks. Always remember, the real pro in your corner should be your healthcare provider. They'll know your health history, your current situation, and they'll help you weave through the complex web of drug interactions and side effects. They're the referee in this boxing match, and you should definitely listen when they start counting to 10. Choosing medication is like choosing a pair of glasses. You want the one that gives you the clearest picture with the least amount of distortion, not just the one with the trendiest frame. Stay dialed in with your health, and maybe swing by the doctor's office before making big changes to your medical routine. And yes, diabetes is a tough opponent, but with the right strategy, you can keep it on the ropes.